All right, I just downloaded the software updater CL14, and uh, that's what you need. And then you also download this DJ07 TAR that has uh, Inexane's kernel, custom recovery 3.1.1, which is the latest. And yeah, so this phone has stock. Oh. It has stock DJ07 on it. That's yeah, in the change. So what time are we leaving in the morning? Well, if they open at ten, it takes two hours to get there. We gotta leave about eight. Well, that's. Are you, are you a late sleeper? You got a C? No, not really. Program files? Samsung Electronics? <laughs> software upgrade? And then you go to models. And then you go to binary. I gotta give her a bath in the morning. If you don't delete place. that, then you'll have a stock ROM on your phone. Mm -hmm. This is for the moment. If you don't delete that and you're doing the transform, your phone won't boot. So make sure you delete this right now. She can go to bed at 11, 12 o'clock and that. She's still up. It's gone. Wow. And then we gotta take this. I put them all in bed at 8 o'clock. Yeah, more. They don't work with her. <laughs> we gotta take this uh, SPH M900 M4 DG07 that we downloaded and we gotta put it in that folder. I showed her something new. <laughs> what a color we did for once. <laughs> in case so, you're curious. When you're a kid and you get in trouble, you can write with three different pins at once. <laughs> In case you're curious, it's 156 megabytes. We're going to open up software upgrade. And then I, I agree. Wow, it does not like this laptop's resolution. I guess it's not a laptop netbook. Pull the battery out. Put it back in. I kind of like my phone at first. It sucks not having a keyboard. But you know, after I get used to it, and it makes it just Hold down the power, volume down, camera, and in key. Do you text a lot? Yeah. Until you see this screen. It takes more than anything. I hardly ever talk on the phone anymore. And you click next. <coughs> Jared had 8,000 texts last month. Over eight it's now. unlimited for right. <laughs> Plug it in. Oh, we did have the, our bill was um, 150 a month. But then I called them and I got them to mark it down and I was like, a little over 80 a month. And still, we still get everything that we had before, just less minutes. We didn't make that many minutes anyways. And it's installing it, so getting somewhere. Sweet. It says connected down here, so I can scroll down and hit next. But I'm gonna wait till this it says it's done. Awesome. Okay, that was quick. Now I gotta unplug the USB cable and click next again. <clears throat> Pull the battery out. Put it back in. Hold down the volume down, camera, and in key until you get to this screen. And hit next. No, don't shoot on the cord. Alright, plug it in. Wait for it to say connected. It's pretty accurate, Wait for it, wait for it. Okay. That happened so oh, I didn't plug it in. <laughs> I'm gonna delete that part. Look at me. Plugged it in. Com three connected. Ah. Next. Oh, start software download. Click start software download. I think it's stuck. This happens sometimes. Um, or Three, two, one. All right. Start this process again, and this time I'm not gonna. 
Very few. I, I don't watch much TV. Terry says that's a lie. Now y'all have cable. Your channel or speed. And that's a, we just got cable. Plug we it in. We haven't even had cable until just like a month ago, maybe. I did it a little too early. Com3 connected. And then I'll put it on speed. And I want to buy a Jeep right now. I think we got more kids moving oh. We're just running through it at this point now because it sometimes you're gonna it's gonna do that. It's not gonna go any further and you're just gonna have to try this process again. I've never experienced this on the transform, but on the moment I've experienced it. Plug it in, com three connected. Com three or not. See? Plug it back in. Com three connected. Sometimes you just gotta plug it in, uh, unplug it, and plug it back in. And we'll try to start software download again. You know it's stuck if it stays at that and it never goes away. <clears throat> there we go. While this is going on, I'm going to go ahead and download the uh, ROM. On here, we'll just scroll down until we see two zero three right here and save it. Now it's downloading and the phone's done, it's rebooting right now. Okay, close the program. You're done from here, you don't need the computer anymore. Oh yeah, if this is gonna happen, it's gonna happen. What you gotta do is pull the battery out. Go into recovery by holding down volume down, talk, and end. Wait, wait. Now let go. Now we're gonna do reboot options. Reboot your system. Now it's going to boot the system. It's going to hang. That's normal. Don't freak out. I said now it's booting. That the ROM is downloading right now, and the phone's rebooting. So I gotta take that file and put it on this phone when it boots up. When uh, Josh moved in with us, we found him looking for some work. I used to cut grass. And this lady had a shed she wanted to tore down. So Josh and I tore the shed down. And she paid us for that. As well, there's a fee to get rid of it, too. She so took it over to the recycling. Then we got money for it. We got money for the shed. And she threw all this other aluminum in there. Okay, there we go. So we are in the system. Menu, settings, about phone. They broke the tailgate on my truck when we took that. Metal. See, it's got it's got Inexane's kernel on it right now, so it, it's it's rooted right now. But we're gonna install a custom ROM on it. So plug in the USB. Mount the SD card. Open the folder. Yeah. You made me color. I made you color. Download, it's almost done. You made me color that. It's pretty, baby. You made me color that. Oh, did I color on your theme? Yeah. 
Hi, sorry. All right, we just take this new Benel radioactive foil rom and we drag it over here to the SD card. Unmount the SD card. Unplug the phone or you will or you won't get into recovery. Pull the battery out. Put it back in, hold down the volume down. Talk and in keys. And let go. And we're gonna apply zip from SD and we're gonna choose radioactive Froyo. Hit this and then hit home. Wash the thing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's my angle. I go for there. Oh, you want to go for there? Jacob was the easiest one I ever had to put to sleep. He would go get his blanket from out of the bedroom. He'd walk in with it. He's about five. My tired hurts. <laughs> he would go lay down. With his Barney. With his Barney. <laughs> Lights. We made progress. Put the cap on it. The trash. Okay. Thank, thank you, mommy. Thank you, mommy. My candy. We got the M900 wireless teaser app. Oh, okay, there's no super user permission. Everything that wants super user permission just gets it automatically. Oh, and you would you like binary and config is installed. So you'll start along anyway. I'll start the teethering. What's in it? No errors. Candy's in there. Open up this. You gotta ask mommy for candy. Mommy, she wants candy. Abby. Amy, she wants candy. This should vibrate. Not right now. It's too late. Yep. And now it's asking to make it a home network. That means later. Okay. In case y'all are curious, we're 20 minutes and 30 seconds into this. Can you tickle you right here? Can you tickle this right there? After I edit it, it'll be much shorter than that. Can you tickle right here? Your daddy was tickling. <laughs> Yeah. Open up Firefox. Google. It's using the internet from his phone now. This is my dad's phone, not mine. Android Teether, internet access. Run a speed test. Everything gets getting a little too late. 
Download 100, 200, Thank you, okay. <gasps> Thank you, 219. Thank you, On here we're reading 0.5. And look, I don't even have a great signal here. Well, it was at two bars. They don't even get a great signal here. That's why Sprint's in an airwave. But anyway, so it's using the phone and it's online. That's the end of this video. I showed you how to how to root it, install a custom ROM, and Wi-Fi teaser's working. Thank you for watching.